Welcome back. It's time now to answer some of your medical questions. We've got sort of a turkey day theme to some of these today. Joining us to answer them is News Channel 5's medical specialist, Dr. David Saria. He is the chief of emergency medicine at Wellington Regional Medical Center. Thanks for coming in the You're day before very Turkey Day. Yeah, that's my favorite time of year. <laughs> so, some Thanksgiving related questions for you. Our first one today is this. Besides making your pants feel tight, are there any real health problems with eating too much on Thanksgiving? Well, it's not, uh, not hard to believe that, yes, there mm -hmm. certainly can be. Matter of fact, the average American eats almost twice as many calories on Thanksgiving Day than they do on wow. any ordinary day. So it, as you can imagine, uh -huh. it is a stressor on sure. the body. But what it does is it can worsen already existing medical problems. So for example, if you have diabetes, for sure it can bump your sugar up. If you have stomach problems like ulcers or gastritis, without a doubt you're going to have some indigestion mm -hmm. or pain. Heart problems? No question, because the blood flow will go to your gut, sure. take blood or oxygen away from the heart, and cause a heart attack. Gallbladder problems, and even we even see an increase in car accidents because people can get a little sleepy, they get behind the wheel, and a little right. fender bender, and we see All them coming in. You bet. So what to do? Really, instead of having that big bolus and filling your stomach up, try to graze mm -hmm. throughout the day. It actually will help uh, prevent some of those things. Okay. All right. That actually leads us right into our next question. You sort of alluded to this. Does turkey really make you sleepy, or is that just an old wives' tale? You know, by now everybody has heard that L-tryptophan in turkey can make you sleepy. But believe it or not, this is a myth as far as whether or not it in and of itself causes sleepiness. Ah. Turkey has L-tryptophan, no question about it. And what that does is increase the serotonin in your brain and can make you a little bit sleepy. However, it's in comparable amounts in other meats as well. So the real culprit is not tryptophan. What wow. it is is a high load of carbohydrates. And what that does is it increases the insulin in your body and then in increase the serotonin and can cause the sleepiness, you bet. So if you stick with more of the meats, you're not going to be as sleepy. Well, no, the meats will also. It's the increased the trip. You bet. Okay. So it's that bolus okay. of carbohydrates. I got so you. really, any big meal can make you sleepy. It's right. not the turkey in and of itself. Got it. Yeah. Not the turkey. There you go. All right, our final question. Is it better to go to the gym before or after the humongous Thanksgiving yeah. meal? Well, well, certainly not one of the first things on my mind tomorrow morning. <laughs> but, uh, the, you know, the timing of when you work out and when you eat is important right. if you exercise on a daily basis. And the reason being is because food in relationship to your workout makes a difference in the way you feel during your workout and also how your body metabolizes the calories. So as a general rule, you want to avoid a big meal for at least three to four hours before you work out. Okay. That's number one. But also your body needs that sugar energy mm -hmm. to get a good workout. And so you want to have a small carbohydrate rich snack before you work out that'll help you make it through the workout afterwards within about an hour you want to have a protein rich meal about 15 to 20 grams of protein and that helps with muscle synthesis as well as the recovery of muscle cells okay. you do that I think you'll see uh, you'll feel a lot better and you'll see better results so carbs first Protein, after. protein afterwards. You got, got it. it. And just calories in versus calories yeah, out, really. Mm -hmm. So pretty easy. You yeah, need a little, little extra if you if you hit the gym. Absolutely, because you're burning more. Right. You bet. All right. Sounds good. Thank you so much, Dr. Saria, for these Turkey Day health tips. And if you have a question for the good doctor, you can always send it in by going to WPTV.com. You'll find our health link there when you scroll down and just look over to the right-hand side. And we have a form there posted so you can send him your question. We will.